Finding a good program to make electrical diagrams in can be interesting. Uh, Visio is actually very good at making diagrams, um, but one of the things about Visio is that uh, you don't have any real electrical components in here. So when I look at it, there's all kinds of things about uh, networking and a lot of whole business charts and things like that one in here. But it's quite easy to make your own components. And what you basically do is here create a new stencil and then you can start making your own components down here. You like a picture of the components and you can find those uh, easy by searching. So I'll go here and do a Morning Star TriStar. And if I search for images, uh, it will find all kinds of things. And there's uh, one here, for example, that I would like to use. To grab this picture, you can just push print screen on your keyboard and it will actually grab uh, the whole screen in here. I now need to only get the piece I want. So I'll go into paint. I'll see it down here. I can go and select the picture I want in here. And then I'll just crop it so I only have that one. Then I'll go back, select the whole thing um, by hitting Control A and then hit copy in here. Can now go back to Visio. I'll paste it in here. And it, the picture is quite large, so I'm going to shrink it a little down here. And to be able to use it, I'll need to add uh, it inside a container in here. So I'll add uh, a container. I will drag it to fit around my picture I created. And I can change uh, this one uh, to say what I want. And you can later, uh, when you pull the component into your layout, you'll be able to change it to what you want to call it. That Important is that you want to group this so it all being treated as one item now. And now you basically have a component. And when you drop it over here, all you have to do is just uh, rename it. And then you have a um, control in here. If you also want to do a battery, uh, I can go back here and go to the search. And see, here's a picture I would like uh, from a battery in here. Again, the same trick, print screen to copy the picture. And I'll go back and paint. I will paste it. I'll select the part I actually want of it. Cut it out to that, select the whole thing uh, and copy it. Go back to Visio uh, and now I will paste that one in here. Again, I don't need one that is almost a full page uh, in size, so I'll shrink it. And now insert a container and drag it around so it matches my edges down here. And I can give it a default description. Select the whole thing. Uh, and now I want to group it and drag it over to my components and give it a name. So if I want to make a small diagram now, I have this one. Before I do that, I'll just go ahead and save this one as uh, my components. And I need uh, a battery. I need a controller. And I'll zoom in a little here so I can see them a little better. And then I need some connectors. Uh, and that's what is called the connector tool up here. So you can see there's now from my uh, container several uh, dots around. So I'll go here and drag a wire from here to there. And I can change the color on the wire, so maybe I actually want this one to be a positive wire. So I'll just make it red. I'll make another connector. And I want to make this uh, black. So in this way, I now have this one. And if I later need to drag around uh, my uh, different things, uh, I will have these wires now being attached in here. And it looks like they're getting across in here, but I can, of course, later go organize them. Basically, now attached to these points, 
makes it easy to do diagrams and reorganize it when you get all the components arranged in here. If you want to print this and have a nice uh, screen with all this, you can actually go in here to uh, print. And if you print to a PDF, uh, it can be uh, fit to one page, for example. So if we go to page setup, uh, you will fit to one by one sheet and it will print a nice PDF file that you can then uh, share with your diagram. But basically, using Visio makes it quite easy uh, to build uh, diagrams uh, with your own components because there is nothing uh, normally in here for electric diagrams.